Okay, you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Mga higala, mga amigo o gamiga. Hey friends. <laughs> Tara, suroy suroy tala sa Argao. <laughs> yeah, I'm still working on that last part. We'll get it down yet. So we are here in Argao, downtown Argao, and it's a uh, seaside. Not sure the name, but it's downtown Argao. <laughs> We're out at, actually at the beaches. It's like Baluarte Bal de Argo. So that's a name. That we were just kind of hanging out at that resort. Yeah. Just chilling out in the back. We actually didn't go into the resort. Just the back. This is free. And then the ocean. It's so pretty. So ocean gorgeous. Ocean gorgeous views out here. Yes. Now, what island is that? In the distance? They're catching fish. I see that. What island is that in the distance? Bahal. Oh, that's Bahal? Yes. Yeah. Oh, um, we're... That's Bahal. Beautiful, beautiful water. I need to put my feet. Next time I need to bring my swimsuit. So every time I see water, I need to jump in. So right now I'm on my yoga pants. <laughs> I feel like I need more exercise. Sometimes. You need to throw on your bikini underneath. Yeah, so we see a, a, a guy a while ago do uh, spearfishing. So he took a picture of that. Yeah, we got some pictures. Yes. We'll have to include that. Yeah. And a little banka, and then that's like a bantai dagat. It's like a guard, boat guard of our gal, that big boat. Oh, okay, bantai that's what that is. Dagat, it's like guard sea, <laughs> coast guard. <laughs> so yeah, there are people swimming over there, so let's check it out more. Uh, what's... But let's head up to the park for right now. Yep. And we'll check that out. Yep. So we are here in Argao downtown. So this is the plaza, Argao Plaza. So we'll start wondering. Let's see how it goes. We have an old, I'm not sure if it's a convent. So basically, this is the church here. Due to recent security concern, this gate will be locked at 10 p.m. It will be open at 5. Uh, oh, this is the... San Miguel Arcanhel Church here in Argao. And of course, I like how they put plastic bottle only. They have red, black, and green trash cans. And a typical church here in the Philippines. For sure, it was built 400 years ago. Beautiful, beautiful day. Beautiful. And the tree bears white flower. We call that Kala Chuchi. Kala Chuchi. And I guess that's the municipal hall over there. And that one, oh, it shows here Hall of Justice. Okay. Eh. So is that kind of like your city courts? Yeah. And of course, Jose Rizal. Jose Rizal over there. We'll see on finding a sit, a chair to sit down. So quiet. Oh, cool. a couple more candles. Yeah, that's cool. It's like a wheel, something. Well, there's a plaque over there. <laughs> what it says. It may have been clear water at one time, but I don't like to be drinking out of it today. <laughs> yeah. Spanish cannon. Spanish cannon were used to defend the Pueblo from Moro. Writers, they were part of fortified walls of the Pueblo. These were brought to Argo in the year 1600 and 700 when a galleon trade visited the town. 
cool. Very cool. That's cool. I never thought about that. Spanish cannon. Canyon cannon. And across. Legislative building. <sighs> Today in Argyle. Just pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. It doesn't tell anything about the well. Yeah. Of course, a famous monument of Rizal. And the municipal hall. The mayor, Vicente Cantonar. Albaraz and Vice Mayor and those are the consulars. Oh, really cool. Cool. Okay. And the Philippine flag. And this is the park. It's actually beautiful. Old uh, stones. So cool. And our Bermuda grass. Yeah, camera got passed off, so you got me for a little bit. I love coming to these old towns like this. And just seeing a lot of the old historic structures. <laughs> Cindy taking photos. Now, most of these coastal towns had these huge watchtowers like that. Dumaguete's got one that is still standing pretty much in its entirety like this. Oslob has one. Uh, more specifically, Oslob has the remnants of one. But there were the old watchtowers to keep an eye out for the Moro pirates and all the bad guys that came up and were invading the area. area. I kind of wonder what the Hall of Justice used to be. Let's go check it out. It is a tad bit warm in the sun. We may have to find a bench somewhere in the shade to do a little bit longer video. Okay, that tells a little bit about it. But I'll probably do a freeze frame on this to let you guys read it. It was rededicated to its current incarnation in 2005 down at the bottom. Very cool. I was hoping to get a little bit more history to what the building was. In Argyle, they've got one like it that was used to be a barracks. Yeah. But that one, the last time we were there, was kind of in ruins. That they were trying to restore it. But I guess most of these blocks were mined from uh, the coral reefs around here. And from the local volcanic structures. Gorgeous old buildings. Look at that. Yeah, that church is impressive. Yeah. From here and then from the clouds out there. I know, I'd love to come out here with a drone. We're going to have to come down here with a drone one of these days. I need to start bringing that with me more often. This is very cool. Yeah. All right, Balai Lungsud. House of the town in Argyle, 1608. 1608. Just look at their rooftop. It's 
Yeah, they're doing some major renovations to it. The executive building, I think, is the the town hall, city hall. Vice Mayor, Councillors, and Treasurers. Very cool. Yeah, we're trying to find some place in the shade and just doesn't look to be a whole lot of places for that. Yeah. I'm gonna go back to the Kingfisher Beach. I might go back to the Kingfisher. Go back to Sabunga. <laughs> I guess most of these towns, like Manila, had this intramuros area. Mm -hmm. It was the old walled city. Yeah. Or Pueblo, as they were calling it. Yeah. Well, there's another beach resort. And so these are the remnants of that old wall. The old town gates. Like Baluarte de Argo Beach Resort. This is limited parking. Baluarte? Yeah. Is that a name or is it a word? It's a name. Okay. Yeah, they've definitely got it so there's no bicycles or anything else to come in here. Then we'll turn around and leave. <laughs> there's other people down here, so. Must not be completely banned. Bit of a step down. Yeah, I think that's a storm drain. Let water come out into the beach. Yeah, I'm thinking this could be kind of comical from your end. I'm not so much sure about my end.
Philippines is definitely not a handicap friendly place. Like, <laughs> just jump right in. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Oh, okay. This is the shade. We find shades. This might actually work. Yeah. Hey, we're going to check out and see what the camera looks like like this. So, 